We begin with the dramatic fallout after that mass shooting at Covenant School in Nashville. Tennessee lawmakers voting to expel three Democrats from the state legislature after they protested for stricter gun control on the floor of that chamber, chanting into a bullhorn, no action, no peace. The Republican Speaker of the House comparing them to January 6 rioters, citing them for disorderly behavior. This morning, supporters of the Capitol welcomed them with cheers and watched in the gallery as the Republican supermajority debated measures to oust them. Since the Covenant shooting, protesters for gun control have gathered at the Capitol a number of times, and they were there once again today, even in the rain. Tennessee has only expelled lawmakers a handful of times, and usually for criminal or sexual misconduct. But this time is very different. ABC's Alex Perez is in Nashville. I hereby declare Representative Justin Jones of the 57th Representative District expelled. Tonight, in a rare move, the Tennessee State House deciding if they should expel three Democratic lawmakers who violated decorum during this moment. Tensions rising as two members were expelled, a third saved. The state representative's outrage is stemming from that shooting at a Nashville elementary school. Three staffers and three students killed. With protesters calling for gun reform at the state capitol last Thursday. Democrats Gloria Johnson, Justin Jones and Justin Pearson interrupting the legislative session. I have to raise the voice of the people in my district. And I did what I felt those folks wanted me to do. Speaker of the House Cameron Sexton on a radio show accusing them of trying to incite an insurrection. What they did today was equivalent, at least equivalent, maybe worse, depending on how you look at it, of doing an insurrection in the Capitol. Pearson knocking down that claim. The thousands of children and adults who marched outside of the People's House are not insurrectionists. My walk, my colleagues' walk to the House floor was in a peaceful and civil manner, and it was not an insurrection. Today, ahead of the expulsion vote, Johnson, Jones, and Pearson walking defiantly into the state capitol amid chants of, we support the Tennessee Three. And tonight, with hundreds chanting outside the chamber, Jones calling this a political lynching. This should sound the alarm across the nation that we're entering into very dangerous territory. He went on to call the House dishonorable, and Alex Perez joins us now from outside the Tennessee Capitol. Alex, what is the White House saying tonight? Yeah, Lindsay, the White House blasting the proceedings tonight, calling them undemocratic and without precedent. Now, any ousted representative will be able to once again run for their seat in a special election if they so choose. Lindsay? Alex, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.